Hey guys, how's it going? Cheers back again with another squad builder and today we've got a 150,000 coin Serie A squad. Now I've not done a Serie A squad yet on my channel, I did put one on the community channel but I haven't yet done one for my own so uh, let's jump straight in with uh, Marchetti in goal, one of the best goalkeepers on the game let alone in Serie A, 87 diving, 89 reflexes, unbelievable, 80 handling and 82 positioning and how he only goes for 3,200 coins I have absolutely no idea whatsoever. In my opinion he plays he feels better to play with Dan Buffon. Uh, genuinely, honestly, he's such a good goalkeeper. He's unbelievable. And uh, let's move into the back three and the defence then. We're going to have Martin Caceres in the middle. 81 pace, 81 defending, 78 heading. Obviously moves from a right back to a centre back for this game where he's been playing for Juventus recently. 2,600 coins paid for a player that's six foot tall and this fast is an absolute bargain. He's been superb for me in this team, as have all the defenders at the back, to be uh, completely honest. Obviously, the uh, the other two defenders kind of go without saying. Angelo Obona is one of them. 77 pace. 82 defending 79 heading an absolute rock he's even better this year than he was last year because of the added uh, impetus on uh, strength etc as is Chiellini his pace has dropped a little bit 77 this year 86 defending 82 heading he's again an absolute monster at the back and he's just impregnable all three of them are so so good at the back into the uh, midfield then and on the right hand side because there aren't any win backs I went for Christian Maggio now uh, he only has a medium defensive work rate but manually you can just bring him back and uh, he's extremely good in the tackle and he's tall he's strong and he's good going forward as well 83 pace 77 defending uh, 74 shot 81 passing 82 heading 75 dribbling a great all-round player as you can see he's got six assists in the 11 games that I've played with this squad so far I haven't actually uh, gone out and got any clips with it yet I've just been kind of playing casually with it and it's been extremely fun to play with now oh Sharawi it's gonna be the player we go for on the left hand side 87 pace 85 dribbling 80 shot and 73 passing I picked him up in a pack opening a few weeks ago sold him on bought him back again for this team Hasn't had the same impact as he did for uh, for me the last time I had him, but still an extremely good player. And actually, considering he uh, he has a high high uh, defensive work rate, but you would presume he uh, he gets forward a lot. But he does track back a lot, track back a lot as well, and support out Ogbonna on this left hand side, and suits this team very very well indeed. And in the two CM roles, we're gonna have Freddie Guarin on the left, and uh, no, not Camp. And on the right, we're going to have. Uh, Arturo Vidal. We'll start with Vidal, one of the best centre mids on the game all round. 79 pace, 82 dribbling, defending and passing. 77 shot, 71 heading. High, high work rates, which can be a bit of a drag stamina wise, but uh, he is so, so good. He scores a lot of goals for me as well from that position. Five in the 11 that I've played so far and three assists as well. Fantastic player, really is extremely good. And Freddy Guarin as well. I've picked him up recently in my Tottenham Career Mode series, and he's just as good on Ultimate Team as well. 78 pace, 82 shot with uh, 82 passing as well, and 83 dribbling. Again, 76 defending and 78 heading, so he's extremely good all round. Same as Vido, and they, they both work so, so well in this particular formation with uh, Teep as well with 4,200 coins, so uh, you can't really complain. And then uh, in front of them, we're going to have Carlos Tevez. I dropped him to, uh, to Cam. He does have the engine trait on him, so. Uh, his passing, dribbling and uh, pace are improved. 81 pace, 85 shot, 84 dribbling, 77 passing and 72 heading in the standout stats. He does everything, Carlos Tevez. He defends, he pushes forward, he creates goals, he scores goals. He's absolutely fantastic in that cam spot. 25,000 coins paid, worth every single penny in my opinion. Then up top, we're going to have Antonio Di Natale on the left and... Uh, Mario Balotelli on the right with the maestro uh, chemistry solo on him, 84 pace 85 dribbling, 82 shot and 75 defending, the maestro improves shot passing and dribbling, just under 30k paid, like I say when I bought this squad it was worth around about 150,000 coins, by the time you see this prices may have dropped but uh, just be aware of that if you're going to go out and pick up any of these players on the back of this, but uh, a wonderful player, 7 goals in the 11 games I've played so far, he's an absolute machine he's so so good, unfortunately he is a little bit lazy with which is disappointing. Occasionally you can be uh, found lagging offside or potentially even dropping too far deep and not keeping up with a counter-attack, but Antonio Di Natale on the other side of that is always in the right position offensively. Absolutely wonderful player. 86 pace, 87 dribbling, 86 shot, 80 passing as well, and uh, just over 30,000 coins paid for him. So the front line alone is worth about 60k, and uh, he's an absolute brute. He's quite strong, actually, considering he is quite small and uh, worth 
like I say, with a lot of these players in this squad, worth every single penny that you're going to spend on it. So that is the uh, squad builder part of this video wrapped up, guys. Feel free to leave a like if you did enjoy the video. Let me know in the comment section down below if there's anyone that you would put in this squad over anyone else. Perhaps you'd have uh, Sebastian Giovinco in there at Cam rather than Carlos Tevez, for example, or maybe a Pirlo in there at CM as opposed to uh, Vidal Aguirre. Let me know, and uh, I will uh, I will take that all on board potentially for another Serie A squad builder later in the year. But thank you very much for watching, guys, and I will see you next time.